everyone. Today I am going to discuss a new method for finding the particular integral of an ordinary differential equation. And the method is the method of variation of parameters. You just watch this. You look at the heading. The method of variation of parameters to find pi. pi means particular integral. So we are discussing how to find particular integral by using a particular method called method of variation of parameters. Method of variation of parameters. This method is used to find the particular integral of a uh, differential equation which is y double dash plus a1y dash plus a2y is equal to f of x. y double dash, see the coefficient, it is 1, unity. a1y dash, y dash whose coefficient is a1, that is a constant. Plus a2y, y whose coefficient is a2, that is also a constant, is equal to f of x. That means this differential equation is a second order non-homogeneous f of x it is uh, entirely a function of x that means this differential equation is a uh, non-homogeneous type with constant coefficients we know for any non-homogeneous differential equation with constant coefficient whose complete solution contains two parts the first part is complementary function and the second part is particular integral. So in this case we are assuming let for this differential equation the complementary function that I used here cf the short form cf means complementary function we are assuming that it is some c1y1 plus c2y2 c1y1 plus c2y2 can you recall uh, i discussed earlier that cf we have three different types of cf they are based on the roots of auxiliary equation uh, suppose the roots are real and distinct it is c1 e raised to m1x plus c2 e raised to m2x can you recall that so in that case y1 is e raised to m1x y2 is e raised to m2x so like that in all the cases three cases we can assume the complementary function as in general it is some c1y1 plus c2y2 then by this method the particular integral is pi is equal to you have to learn this equation y1u plus y2v y1 y2 these are two functions already we having a complementary function so that is y1 and y2 so in pi in this new method in pi we are introducing two new variables one is u and the other is v we have separate equations for both u and v u is equal to minus integral y2 f of x divided by w dx see once more i'll say the uh, equation u this u is equal the first variable u is equal to it starts with a negative sign so minus integral the big integral y2 y2 is the second function in cf y2 into f of x divided by w dx w w is we already we know it is a round skin okay f of x is the right side of non-homogeneous differential equation so once more u is minus integral y2 f of x by w dx and v see v is equal to integral y1 f of x by w dx once more i'll say the equation v is equal to integral it is positive see the sign it is positive y1 y1 is the function obtained in cf this y1 into f of x is the rhs f of x divided by w w is the round skin w into dx where w w c can you recall w is equal to the round skin of y1 and y2 that means round skin we know it is determinant y1 y2 y1 dash y2 dash this is called the round skin so whenever we are dealing with the, this method method of variation of parameters you have to learn these equations by heart or somehow you have to learn this that means uh, what are the equations so let me revise once more cf is c1y1 plus c2y2 then by this method our pi particular integrals is y1u plus y2v where u is equal to minus integral y2 f of x by w dx v is equal to integral y1 f of x by w dx 
where W is Y1, Y2, determinant Y1, Y2, Y1 dash, Y2 dash. So after finding particular integral uh, by uh, y finding u and v also w you will get pi then the complete solution we can write the complete solution as uh, cf plus pi that gives a final solution of this non-homogeneous differential equation by the method of variation of parameters let me discuss uh, one example see the example solve by method of variation of parameters the differential equation y double dash plus y is equal to cosec x. y double dash plus y is equal to cosec x whose complementary function we should find first. For that we are assuming cosec x is equal to some 0. So y double dash plus y is equal to 0. Uh, okay. Then find the roots of auxiliary equation and you find the uh, from the roots you from the three different cases uh, we will get a complementary function as, as uh, it comes under the third category uh, cf is equal to c1 cos x plus c2 sin this is the final answer you can check it separately okay here i wrote only the final answer cf is equal to c1 cos x plus c2 sin x then particular integral pi by the formula pi is equal to y1 u plus y2 v this is from the method of variation of parameters this is the formula where u is equal to we know it is minus integral it is a minus integral y2 f of x by w dx y2 in this case y2 is sin x and f of x is cosec x so minus integral sin x into cosec x divided by w by the formula it is by w w already i calculated w it is ronskin y1 y2 y1 dash y2 dash so cos x sin x cos x whose derivative is minus sin x sin x whose derivative is cos x so you expand the determinant and whose value will be 1 therefore u is equal to minus integral sin x into cosec x divided by w w its value is 1 into tx uh, you integrate by uh, integration method by using some integration method you evaluate u and v is equal to uh, integral v by the formula v is equal to integral y1 f of x by w dx so v is equal to you substitute those values y1 means it is cos x so cos x into cosec x dx integral cos x into cosec x you integrate by integration technique so finally what we will get is it is uh, minus x into cos x pi pi y1 u u is uh, minus x so minus x cos x plus sin x into log sin x see this value we will get the value of u as x and v as log sin x so particular integral is minus x cos x plus sin x into log sin x and here one more line i should write here uh, that is the complete solution we know the complete solution y is equal to cf plus pi that also you have to attach okay so the complete solution we obtain by the method of variation of parameters now if you want i will give you a few a few more questions uh, uh, solve y double dash plus y is equal to sec x by the method of variation of parameters also you can try y double dash plus 4y is equal to tan 2x by the same method thank you